What's up everybody, TacticalRection7 here, back with the Minecraft mod tutorial. Today's mod tutorial will be on the Mine Canical Gravity mod, and what this mod does is it adds three new blocks to Minecraft, which are the Attractor, Repulsor, and Gravitor. So let me go ahead and log into Minecraft here, and then hop into my world, and I will show you what these blocks do. So you can see here I have the Attractor, the repulsor and the gravitor and I also have these um, gravity boots and these will make it to where if you're holding them or wearing them you will not uh, feel the effects of these blocks so I'll go ahead and turn them on I'll hold them when I turn the blocks on so I have the block on and this is the attractor so if I go ahead and stop holding the boots you'll see that it attracts me to the block so that is what the attractor does, it just pulls you into it. Now we have the repulsor, and this basically pushes you away, so the opposite of the attractor. Maybe I should turn it on first. <laughs> okay, I'll stop holding the boots, and there you go, you can see it push me away. And you cannot get to it, it's pretty much impossible to walk to it so again I'll show you pushes you away and then we have the gravitor and this pretty much takes away gravity so if I let go of the boots again you can see that I will start floating it almost looks like I'm using creative mode to fly but I'm not this is the effects of the block hopefully I don't die right here that was close so you need to be careful these can kill you. So to craft everything, if we go ahead and come over to the crafting table, you can see this is to create the attractor and you put four iron ingots around the corners like this and all of the blocks will take four iron ingots to create them as well as a compass and all but the gravitor will use four redstone as well. So that will give you your attractor and then to create the repulsor you take the redstone and put it in the corners instead of putting the iron in the corners so just like this and now we have our repulsor so now if I go ahead and hit O and load up the second load to create the gravity boots we need two iron ingots and two attractor blocks and there's our gravity boots and like I said for the gravitor you only need one redstone so then we take our four iron and place them in the corners like this place our redstone in the middle at the bottom and in our compass in the middle and that is our gravitor so that is how to craft everything and that is what the three blocks do so I now need to clean out my minecraft jar after I do that I'll be back and I'll show you how to install this mod Okay, so what you're going to need to install this mod is some sort of archiving program such as WinRAR, 7-Zip, or WinZip. Now, all these archiving programs will work the same, so you can use whatever you prefer. I will be using WinRAR in this tutorial. Then you're going to need to download ModLoader and the Mindcanical Gravity mod itself. So to get these two files, I'll go ahead and give you the link to these two pages in the description. So first off, to download the Mindcanical Gravity mod, if we go ahead and scroll down, you can see this is where we'll be downloading it from, but if you go ahead and scroll down a little bit further, and go to how it works and click on show this is how to craft everything and it, it just all the information about the mod is on this page but to download it you want to go ahead and click on version 0 0.1 and that will bring us over to an ad fly and it will say please wait five seconds up in the top right hand corner after the five seconds is up a yellow button saying skip ad will appear go ahead and click on the skip ad and that will take us over to a media fire and click on download to download the mod now for mod letter, go ahead and come over to Resigami's mods and scroll down until you see mod letter 1.1 and you can either do download from AdFly or Direct, whatever you prefer to do. I usually tend to download from Direct because then I just get it from straight from this page. So that is how you're going to download the files you'll be installing. So when you're ready to install, go ahead and come over to start, then type in percent app data percent, just like this down here. Go ahead and go into your roaming, then open your dot .minecraft, then open your bin left click your minecraft jar then right click it and do open with 
and select whatever archiving program you're using. I'm using WinRAR, so I'm going to go ahead and open it with WinRAR. Now your bin, we do not need any more, so go ahead and just close that. So once you have your Minecraft jar open, go ahead and open up Mod Loader and highlight all these class files and drag them into your Minecraft jar and hit OK. Now go ahead and close Mod Loader. Now open up the Mind Canical Gravity Mod and highlight all these files and drag them into your Minecraft jar and hit OK. And go ahead and close the Mind Canical Gravity Mod. Now in your Minecraft jar, you should see a folder called MetaInf. If you do not see this folder, it's OK. You can go ahead and just skip this step. But if you do see it, what you want to do is delete it. So go ahead and left click it, then right click it. Select Delete Files, then hit Yes. And that'll delete MetaInf. You want to make sure you always delete MetaInf when you're installing a mod. If you don't, it'll cause Minecraft to crash. So after you delete MetaInf, you go ahead and close the Minecraft jar. And that's it. You're done installing the mod. So I hope this video helped you guys out. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.